Howdy, howdy, neighbors. Oh, it's old Pops back. Listen, we got a good one today. Got a lot happening. Um, let me pull my chair up here. There we go. As you can see, I got the twice shirt on today. We got a big uh, deep dive today. It's going to be a long Pops cast, so strap in <laughs> we got a lot of information to get to a lot of stuff happening uh we're gonna have a lot of fun though so we appreciate y'all being with us appreciate y'all watching don't forget like comment share subscribe all that kind of stuff let us know if there's something you want to see let us know if there's news you want to see okay and we'll get to it now first things first we got the birthdays it's birthday shout out time now if your favorite art favorite artist or yourself is not on the list let us know and we'll get it done okay our birthday man has been really busy the past couple weeks so i had to use the birthdays we had from last year uh and a few that i had gotten um so we'll go from there um but we don't have a complete list today uh, I'm sure we don't because there's some that we don't have on here yet, and I didn't have time to get to them. But uh, the Blockheads got Matthew R. on the 11th. Happy birthday, buddy. Uh, the Artist on the 1st, Shion from Dreamcatcher. Happy birthday. Very happy birthday to all the artists, all our blockheads. We appreciate all of y'all. Hope y'all have a great, great day. Uh, the third, Bang Chan from Stray Kids and Jordy from Rocket Punch. The fourth, Ilhan from B, uh, B2B. Zhang Han from 17 and Gino from, or Jinu from KRD or card. Uh, the fifth. So Yan from Tiara. Yunjin from Zykers and Hunter from Zykers. Uh, they're new. We just premiered them not long back, as a matter of fact. Here. Um, the sixth. Hani from New Jeans. Juhan from Monster X. Lula from Wecky Mecky. Uh, he only from Is One. And Jenna from Queen's Eye. The eighth, Yunjin from La Seraphim. Uh, the ninth, Heian and Yia from Signature, and Yubin and Miku from Pink Fantasy. The tenth, Susie from Miss A, Sung Hee from CLC, and Young 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 from NCT. Uh, the eleventh, Sojin from Nine Muses, and Aron from Fifty Fifty. The twelfth. Jung Ho from uh, A.T.'s and Han Bell from Dream Note. Ah, that's the first page. Whew, we got a lot to do today. 15th, uh, Yun Yong from Brave Girls and He Song from N Hypen. 16th, Wu Bin from Crabity. Uh, 17th, Harum from Brave Monster. Lily from N Mix. And Irie from Rolling Courts. Looking forward to all them, too. Uh, by the way, as we go through these, my friends, um, if there's, if you want to get a birthday request in for your favorite artist, or you want to get a birthday request in for yourself or a family member or whatever, we're happy to do it. Everything is down in the description. Just open up the description box. Everything is down there on how to do that. Okay. The 19th, Heejin from Luna. The 21st, uh, 21st, excuse me, Yachan from Zykers and Yuri from IZ1 on the 22nd, or is one on the 22nd. Uh, the 23rd, 20, 
third, excuse me, Minnie from Idol, Hana from Queen's Eye, and Neening from Espa. The 25th, Lee No from Stray Kids, and Miso from Dream Note. 26th, Sion from Weekly. Uh, the 27th, Ja Young from Rolling Quartz. The 30th, Boney from or Bonnie from Dream Note and G uh, Giselle from Espa. And the 31st, Halloween Day. One of them, yeah, it's my favorite holiday of the year, to be honest with you. Uh, Young Jung from Rolling Quartz. So that's our birthdays for the month. Happy birthday to everybody. Hope you have an absolutely fantastic day. Now, let's get into the music news. Um, got some news just this week that Itzy, Twice, and Blackpink are now the only female K-pop groups ever to be on the Billboard Top Current Album Sales charts for 90-plus cumulative, uh, cumulative weeks. Very big congrats to all the ladies. Very cool to hear that. Uh, new music coming up from, oh my gosh, we got a lot of new music coming. And when they drop stuff, y'all let me know and we'll get it done, okay? Happy to do it. As quick as we can possibly get it. All due out in October. Got new music from New Jeans. NCT 127, I, G, uh, Idol, Espa, Extenary Heroes, Genie, Light Sum, We In, from Mamamoo, Whew. TXT, 17, Billy, and possibly Queen's Eye, and maybe Baby Monster. We're not sure about that one yet, but we'll get to that here in just a minute. Because there is some news on the YG front, and it's not good. Uh, confirm news. The founder and the representative uh, producer of YG Entertainment, uh, Young Hun Sok, is bit of a, he's in a bit of a pinch right now legally. Um, evidently, the prosecutors in a case of his are pushing for a three-year prison sentence so now the thing about it is when you take a company as big as YG for instance right there's contingencies in place people to take over this kind of thing you know but that's not good news for YG and their stock is dropping like a rock right now so I don't know what's going to happen um, and that's based on you know the rumors about Blackpink, and, you know, they've got Baby Monster up and coming, so there's a lot going on at YG right now. Um, hopefully all this will work out, but it's hard to say at this point. Uh, stocks have fallen almost 24% since the beginning of the year at YG, so it's crazy right now. Now, on that front, Jenny and Jizu from Blackpink are both said, and this is actually, it's kind of sad news. At the same time, it's good news. And at the same time, it's kind of funny. Jenny and Jizu from Blackpink are both said to be opening their own management companies and or label. Um, however, when asked about it from reporters, they both just smile. Nobody's saying nothing. So we don't know at this point. Uh, that is rumored, but we do know that Jenny is working on a full solo album right now. Now, whether that is under her own label, whether that is under Jisoo's label, what is the, I, I don't know what's going on with that. Nothing is confirmed on that at this point, just that she is working on a solo album. So, I don't know. We're going to find out in the next probably month what's going on with all that, my friends. So, we'll keep an eye on it. We'll let you know as soon as we know. 
it's a very weird thing going on over there right now with YG. So, okay, new stuff on the channel, right? Um, Pop Sings. Y'all have asked me to sing a song. I'm happy to do that, right? We'll have some fun, if nothing else. Y'all can get a good laugh. I'll get a good. We're all going to have a good time. We just put the second poll up. What we did was we took the top two songs from the first poll. We're going to take the top three songs from the second poll. We're going to put them in a poll next week. Over the course of the week. And then I'll sing the top one that comes down. I don't know why y'all want to see that, but we're going to have some fun anyway. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, also, the Song of the Year polls will start next week, right? We're going to break it down to 15, top 15 of the year, to do at the end of the year, the last week of the year, right? So we're going to start them next week. We have some good suggestions already, some great things that should be on there for sure. Uh, if there's something y'all want to get on those polls, you let me know uh, down in the comments of this video or any other video. I get them all. Y'all let me know if there's a song, just mark it S-O-T-Y and we'll get it on there. Okay? And we'll get them pulled up starting next week and start moving them through. All right? Until we get to the top 15 sometime in December, and then we'll do that countdown at the end of December. There's also some changes coming to this channel. We've got some new equipment getting set. Uh, we've got some things we're doing. Um, some things that'll be added, some things that'll be moved, different things. We got some different apps we're using and stuff like that. Uh, and we're trying to get to the Twitch stream. I've got to get everything set up for that. Yes, we do have the monitors now. Uh, we've got to get all the cording and all that and get it all set up. But we are working on it. So, all that will be coming. Uh, around the 1st of December, I am going to put up a post over on a community page. That will have all the links to the new stuff, all that kind of thing on it. So that everybody can get to the you know all the different things we're going to use okay and all the stuff that's going to be happening and that will remain up there right now we'll put the polls up there and all that no we haven't gotten away from the polls any of that so but we will be doing all that um it'll be coming so we're going to get to all that okay yes we are working on it all right now get a drink here because we got a heck of a deep dive today nine members this is twice and we're looking forward to it so let's have some fun find out all about twice uh they debuted on october 20th 2015 with their first single like ooh ah uh we've done the video to that so yeah and we did the first album. Uh, the fandom name is Once, which I love that. And the official colors of the fandom uh, are Apricot and Neon Magenta. Very cool. I like that. Now, let's get into the members. Uh, they debuted under JYP Entertainment. They're still with JYP Entertainment. As a matter of fact, they re-signed their contracts last year. So... But they are doing some solo stuff too. As a matter of fact, Jizu or uh, Geo, Jizu, Geo just released her first solo album, and wow, whew, good stuff. Speaking of Geo, uh, she is the leader. She was born Park Jisoo on February first, nineteen ninety-seven. She legal or ch legally changed her name to Park Geo. Um, for purposes of the group, as far as we can tell, which is cool. Uh, she's the leader and main vocalist. 
Her representative color is apricot. Uh, her official color four twice. But her favorite color is red. She trained the longest. She trained for 10 years. She started when she was in third grade um, and trained for 10 years before debut of twice. So she, she was there a long, long time. A lot of work. Uh, she was voted be the leader of twice by anonymous vote by the members. Uh, JYP had nothing to do with that vote. That was strictly through the members. Uh, she's ambidextrous. Right hand, left handed. I like that. Things we don't know. I like See, that's what I love about these. Is we find out things we didn't know. That's always fun. Uh, she loves to eat yogurt, smoothies, chicken, and beef. But hates broccoli. She can't stand broccoli. Well, okay. I can I can see that. There's things I don't like to eat either, so I understand. Uh, excuse me. Uh, let's see. She enjoys webtoons. And her favorite music is R&B and soul. But she listens to classical music when she's unable to sleep. Uh, she was named the. <laughs> this is funny. She was named the best alcohol drinker by the members. Uh, she likes soju. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> uh, the members also say she's the agio machine of twice, the cute machine. And they nicknamed her Thomas the Train because of her big eyes, and she can imitate Thomas. I don't know what the Thomas the Train is, but okay, that's funny. Uh, she's extremely scared of bugs. And the members say she cries the most in twice. <laughs> Which is funny because she's the leader. Geo says her ideal type would be someone that can show her, that she can show her true self with and be comfortable with. Okay, I like that. That's cool. Uh, Nyon. Uh, she was born M. Nyon on September 22, 1995. She is the Unnie, the oldest. She's the lead vocalist and center of Twice. Her representative color, her official Twice color is sky blue, but her favorite color is purple. Uh, she says her favorite number is nine because twice has nine members. That's cool, right? Always about the members and, and once. Um, I didn't know this. She has a weak left leg due to an accident, an auto accident when she was a child. I did not know that. See, that's the kind of stuff you dig up when you're doing stuff like this. Uh, Nyon and Jenny and Jisoo from Blackpink are really close friends. Didn't know that either. Her nickname or outside stage name, I guess you'd say, is MC Rail. <laughs> Where they got that from, I don't know. Uh, she loves badminton. And she loves to eat jellies and sweets. But does not like chicken feet. Okay. I guess chicken feet is a big food over in Korea. She's a huge fan of Oh My Girl. Didn't know that either. That's cool. Uh, and she loves to support other artists. She often attends their concerts. And twice has often attended, as a group, uh, several other artists' can uh, concerts. They're big supporters. So that's really cool, too. Uh, let's see. Da, 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 da. She is scared of the sea and fireworks. She doesn't like to be out at sea, and she doesn't like fireworks. Okay, I didn't know that either. She probably flinches when they get some of them big booms in concert, huh? Um, she, has a, she has a habit of frowning when she's concentrating on something. Looks like she's mad, but she's really not. <laughs> um, 
She's also a huge IU fan. Well, who's not? So, you know, that's almost like natural. Uh, she says she is not a great cook, um, which as far as I know, she doesn't cook much. But Gio says she makes real good pho and chicken rice. And she likes people that are trustworthy and dependable. I like that, too. Very cool. Jung Yon. Uh, born Yu Young Wan on November 1st, 1996. She changed her name to Yu Jung Young. She's the lead vocalist. Uh, her dad is a popular chef. Uh, he worked for the former president of Korea and at the Seoul Plaza Hotel as the head chef for 20 years, I think they said. Very cool. Accomplished chef. Um, she was accepted to JYP and SM on the same day, but chose JYP. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, she got the second highest votes for leader of twice by the members. So she's kind of the, uh, I guess you'd say the, who's in charge if Geo's out. <laughs> Which is cool. I like that. Uh, but, 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 but. Her representative color is yellow or green. Uh, she likes nano blocks and Legos. Well, that's cool. And she once scolded Nyon for touching her Legos when she was busy with something. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> uh, let's see. She plays saxophone, guitar, and recorder. I didn't know she played guitar. I knew she played the sax, and I she played the recorder on this last tour that they were just on. I didn't know she played guitar, though. She loves meat, but hates Lotus. She's called the mother of twice. Yeah, she's pretty motherly to him. She pretty much takes care of him. I like that. Uh, she's ambidextrous as well. And it says the best part of her day is when she gets to take her contact lenses out. Yeah, well, I don't blame you. <laughs> don't blame her a bit on that one. Um, she loves to clean. Like clean house, what have you. She was in charge of cleaning the dorm when they were in the dorms, which is cool. Uh, says she does not like perfume, but she likes to use body mist. That's cool. And says her ideal guy would be someone who makes her feel comfortable and who is funny. Well, she's hilarious, so yeah, could see that. Could definitely see that. Oh, here we go. Momo. All right. She was born Harai Momo on November 9, 1996. She is the main dancer, sub vocalist, and a sub rapper. She can do all. Um, and what a dancer. She was born in Kyoto, Japan. Her name means peach in Japanese. I guess that's why they call them the peach sisters, huh? Her and Nyon. Plus, they're always together. I think they live together still. Uh, her representative color is pink. Her official color is pink. Says her favorite number is 64 because her, it's her father's football number. That's cool. I like that. Uh, she's a specialist in urban and hip-hop dance. Cool. Nicknamed the Dancing Machine. She's also nicknamed the Eating Machine by members. <laughs> uh, she loves to eat... Uh, especially joke ball, but hates drinking milk and eating melons. She doesn't like melons at all and doesn't like milk, evidently. 
She loves to watch dramas when she can't sleep. Well, yeah, I can understand that. Uh, she loves dolls and stuffed animals. She's extremely scared of heights. And she's allergic to salmon. Well, that's a bad allergy. I like salmon. Myself. Uh, says she recommends going to the Arena Onsen, the hot springs in Japan in wintertime. Well, yeah, I could see that. Great thing to do. She's well known to fall asleep with her hair wet. So jung Yan will dry it for her in the dorms, when they're in the dorms. Um, I don't know if she still does because they, they live separately now, but <laughs> I'm almost known to fall asleep wherever. So... <laughs> Uh, says she likes guys that eat well but are not overweight. Okay. That's cool, too. Uh, Miss Sana. She was born, and I'm probably going to butcher some of these names. Minitazaki Sana on December 29th, 1996. She's a sub-vocalist and a great dancer as well. Uh, she was born and raised in Osaka, Japan. Her representative color is purple. Official color is purple. But her favorite colors are purple, pink, white, beige, and black. Her favorite number is 12 because it's her birth month, she says. Uh, she's close friends with Mion from Idol. And she says she's a specialist in calligraphy. I didn't know that either. I know she has good handwriting because we saw that on the, um, and she was able to fool Momo on one of the time to twice things, or some, uh, I don't remember what it was. The, it was one of them, and it was, uh, special friend, that's what it was, when they did the Secret Santa. Uh, she hates to be alone. Well, she, yeah, she's, she's a big hugger. We all know that. So, uh, she's afraid of thunder. Did not know that. She loves spicy food and yogurt smoothies. She's a very optimistic person, but she's extremely clumsy, too. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> uh, she's allergic to pollen. Oh, that's a terrible allergy as well. She loves to shop. Well, yeah, I can see that. And she loves to be in her bed, says it's her favorite place. Other than being on stage with once. Uh, she hates, <clears throat> excuse me, she hates eggplant. Didn't know that. And she loves to watch horror movies and <laughs> will scream as she watches them. As she continues watching, she'll be screaming. She loves horror movies, though. That's cool. I'm a big horror movie fanatic. So, love that. Uh, she likes to untangle knots. It's a hobby, she says. And she's been voted as one of the most beautiful faces at least twice. Well, yeah, I can see that too. Says her ideal type is someone who works hard and treats his parents well. Well, hard work. Uh, they, these ladies work hard every day, so... Yeah, I understand that, too. Mina. Uh, born Miui Mina on March 24th, 1997 in San Antonio, Texas. She was actually born here in Texas. Um, but they moved back to Japan when she was a young toddler. Um, I think they said three or four years old. So, yeah, wasn't here long. Uh, she is a, <clears throat> excuse me, a main dancer and a sub vocalist. Well, as I said, she's one of the most proficient dancers in the business. So, and her voice is whew. her English name is Sharon. Uh, her representative color is mint. Her official color is mint. 
Her dad is a, com- a clinical professor at Osaka University Hospital. I didn't know that either. I knew he was a doctor, but I didn't know he was, yeah. Cool. Uh, Mina was a member, member with the shortest training period, approximately a year and a half. Uh, she was a ballerina for 11 years before going to JYP, though. So, yeah, very cool. Her favorite ballet is uh, La Corsair. Her nicknames are Black Swan and Penguin. <laughs> Yeah, Black Swan I knew, Penguin I knew. Um, She's very quiet and reserved in private, and I understand that too. She's a quiet person, and that's okay. Nothing wrong with that. She loves the Harry Harry Potter series. I didn't know that. She's a Hermione fan. And also enjoys uh, action and thriller films. That's cool. She loves to eat snacks and is known by the members as the ketchup queen because she loves to eat eggs with ketchup and always has ketchup with her because she has to have ketchup when she's eating. The ketchup queen, I love that. (laughs) Says her favorite sentence is the uh, opposite of love is not hate but indifference. I really like that. That's a great saying. Says her ideal type is someone who is decisive and kind and playful. That's cool. Ah, Miss Diane. Kim Diane, born March 28, 1998. She's the lead rapper and sub vocalist. Yeah, she can do both very, very well. Uh, Her representative color is white, her official color, white. Her favorite number is 7 because she became a twice member on July 7th. So 7-7. I like that. Uh, She auditioned for JYP, SN, SM, and YG and was accepted to all three but chose uh, JYP. Very cool. That's how good they are. They were accepted by three different major companies, you know. Uh, but, 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 but what did it say? She is scared of animals. Did not know that. Uh, but she ain't scared of bugs at all. Um, she went viral with her eagle dance on the 16th. We saw that. It was really, really cool. It's a cool dance. <laughs> Funny. Um, and became very, very popular because of it. Uh, she got the nickname Tofu because of her white skin tone and says she doesn't mind it. <laughs> That's cool. Uh, she loves to drink chocolate milk, but enjoys milk of all types. So that's cool. I like that. I like milk too, myself. Um, says she can't live without chocolate. She has to have chocolate. Kind of understand that. I'm not a big sweets eater, but I do like a piece of chocolate every now and then. Uh, She's a very good songwriter and pianist, according to the members. Uh, Well, she's a great pianist in the first place. Uh, And I know she wrote, I think it was when we were kids, wasn't it? And a few others that she had a hand in writing. And they've written some great songs. So I can see that. Uh, says she cannot watch horror movies. She can't do it. She hates being alone in dark places. Get that as well. Uh, she wears contact lenses. I didn't know her eyesight was bad. And she smiles when she's stressed. To relieve the stress. That's cool. I like that. She likes to watch TV when she can't sleep. And says she likes guys that are dependable and nice. Like that, too. Very cool. Oh, we're down to this. Che Young. Uh, born Chun, Sun Che Young on April 23rd, 1999. Her English name is 
Katrina. Uh, her representative color is red. Her official color is red. Our favorite number is 29. Two for twice and nine for the members. Nine members. I, see, I think stuff like that is really cool to find out. Um, what do we got? Yeah, she's the main rapper and sub vocalist. She can do both very, very well as as well. Uh, she and Rose are from Blackpink are very close friends. Did not know that either. Uh, she attended the Hanlim Multi Art School and loves to draw and is an accomplished artist. Uh, very accomplished. She likes basketball. I didn't know that either. And likes Disney cartoons. Well, I mean, that's understandable. Uh, she loves healthy foods like vegetables, but is not a big sweets eater. Okay. Uh, she does not like beans. And Nyan makes fun of her about this. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> that they can make fun of each other. That's that's hilarious to me. <laughs> she loves to sleep and can fall asleep just about anywhere. Her nickname is Baby Beast. And according to what everything says, she got the nickname Baby Beast because she is the shortest member of Twice. She's little bitty. Uh about five foot two from what I understand. Um, but she's an absolute beast on the stage because she absolutely draws a crowd's attention when she starts working. I like that. Really do. Um, Let's see, what else? She loves to sleep, but listens to music when she can't sleep. And thinks. Loves to think. Well, and read a dictionary. That's that's cool, too. I like that. She, on, she and Nyan both took ballet as students, but neither one of them were able to keep up with it with everything else they had going on, so they're not proficient like Mina is. And that's, you know, that's okay. Hey, they, they tried it, you know. Uh, she is shy to sing in front of the other members. I didn't know this either. Even though she can sing as good as she can rap, she's very shy to sing in front of the other members, except when they're on stage. Did not know that. Uh, her favorite colors are black and purple. I like that. Black is my favorite color. So, And it says her favorite type would be someone who dresses well and can take care of her well. Very cool. Like that one too. Uh oh, we're down to the down to the mock day. Who? Uh, born Chow Suzu, uh, Cha Chow Chewy, on June fourteenth, nineteen ninety nine. She is the lead dancer, sub vocal, visual, and mock day. She was born and raised in Tainan, Taiwan. Uh, her representative color is blue. So her official color is blue. I like that too. Her favorite number is 25 because she thinks the number is cool. <laughs> I like that. That's just cool. <laughs> I just think 25 is a cool number. So <laughs> I like that. Uh, she's the tallest member of twice. Yeah. She is definitely that. I think she's five foot seven and a half is what it said. Uh, her parents own a chain of dermatology clinics in Taiwan. I knew, I think it said at one point her dad was a doctor or her mom was a doctor or something. Evidently dermatologists because they own clinics. Didn't know that. Very cool. Uh, she is the early riser of twice. She wakes up the earliest, but she also goes to bed the earliest. So, good on you, Chewy. I'm an early riser myself. Always have been. So, 
Uh, she likes the Star Wars films, which is where she got one of her nicknames, Yoda, because she loves the character of Yoda. I like that, too. I'm a big Star Wars fan as well. And she can also imitate Yoda. Uh, she's also nicknamed Chocolate because of her skin tone, her dark skin tone, and Chewy. Her favorite color is Indigo. And she likes tonkatsu and kimbap and loves to drink chocolate milk. She's the first ever idol from Japan, or I mean uh, Taiwan. That's cool. I like that too. Uh, she likes springtime, but is not a fan of winter because she gets cold in winter. So she says winter is scary because she gets cold. She doesn't like it. I get that. I was raised in Minnesota, so I know the feeling. Uh, let's see. She often sleeps with her eyes open. Didn't know that. I know people that do that, though. She's a huge fan of the group Sistar. Uh, learned how to skateboard for a commercial. I didn't know that either. Uh, she was modeling before twice from what I understand, so didn't know she learned how to skateboard for that, though. Uh, her favorite saying is, hard work never betrays. Don't be selfish and work hard. You can achieve anything. That's a great saying, too, because it's true. Work, Hard work does not betray, period, right? Kind of like the saying, when somebody shows you who they are, believe them. You know, if they show you who they truly are, then you can believe that. Because they're not going to lie. But you can't lie about that. You know? Uh, she's been voted at least six times into the most beautiful women or beautiful faces in the world. And says she likes someone who can approach her first. I like that too. Very cool. So, that's the deep dive into twice, my friends. What a good one. A lot of info there. I like that. So, that was a long one, I know. I'm sorry. Um, But, we got twice coming up this afternoon. We got a big deep dive into them. Going to have some fun. Y'all come join us for that. Um, And then, of course... Starting this week, like I said, we've got a lot of things going and got the Song of the Year polls starting next week. we got the Pop Sings polls up now. Um, have one more after this. We're going to take the top five and we're going to put them on a list and I'm going to do the top one after next week. Not this week, but next week. After next week's poll. Okay? So, we're going to have some fun with that. I I don't know, but I'm game. We're going to have a good time anyway. Uh, anyway, twice coming up this afternoon, my friends. Come join us for that. I hope you all have an absolutely fantastic day, and I'll see you later with that. This old pops. We are out. <laughs>